Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve the error code 0x8007049 that you are experiencing on your Windows 10 computer. So this could definitely be a frustrating issue, particularly if you're trying to update Windows. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process and we're going to go ahead and jump right into it. So we are going to start off by opening up the start menu. Type in troubleshoot, best result, should come back with troubleshoot settings. Go ahead and left click on that. Select additional troubleshooters on the right panel here. And then you want to go and select Windows Update, resolve problems that are you from updating Windows, and select run the troubleshooter. Okay, so once that's done, go ahead and click on close. You want to go ahead and close out of here. Restart your computer. If you're still experiencing a problem, you want to go now back to the start menu. Type in CMD. Best result should go back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive the user account control prompt, go ahead and select yes. Now into this elevated command line window, I'm going to have two different commands. Copy the first one. It's going to be an SFC space forward slash scan now command. And then go up to the top bar of the command prompt window here. Right click on it. Select edit and then select paste to paste it in. Hit enter on your keyboard to begin the system file checker utility scan. This will take some time to run so please be patient.
Okay, so once that scan is done, we're going to go copy the second command I'll have in the description of the video here, guys. It's going to be a DISM command, so go copy that and then paste it in the same way we did the first one. And hit enter. Okay, so once that's done, you can close out of here, and you want to restart your computer. Okay, guys, there you go. That should hopefully be about it. So, as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. do hope that I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.